everybody, Goopin' Q here, here with The Wolf Among Us. This is a game I've been wanting to play ever since it came out, fucking back in 2013. And it's like, I've... Like, around to the... Like, when the last season came out, I watched the whole thing, but it's been so long since then. I think it came out in 2015 or something. That I don't remember how it went, other than a couple details. So, now that it was on sale for, like, five bucks, I was like, I'm gonna fucking get it and play it myself. Cause I fucking love fucking grimdark fairy tale shit. That's just my jam. And I haven't really ever played a Telltale game before, so it's like we're gonna we're gonna figure this out and shit. Yeah, let's do this. Holla. Connecting. I don't know if I'm supposed to play this with a controller or with my. Mouse or what? What? Brr. We're gonna find out together, my friends. Aha! I can play with my controller. Awesome. This is the Wolf Among Us. Play. Save file one. Holla. Episode 1, Faith. Start episode. Holla! Let's try not to die. Holla! The scene, this game series out of touch choices the make. The story is tailored by how you play. Once upon a time in New York City, there lived a community of fairy tale characters known as Fable Town. The fables who lived there arrived hundreds of years ago after they were exiled from their homelands. Through the use of a magic spell called Glamour, they protected their sacred community from the mundane world. Sheriff Bigby Wolf protects them from each other. I've been to New York City. It's garbage. There's so much garbage. Today again, if you missed it, a record for the date. Hottest ever in June. Uh, 103 now, and that humidity looks low. But remember, the hotter the air is, the more moisture it can hold. So 103 with 31% humidity is a lot more humid than, say, 73 with 31% humidity. And it is muggy out there. Give me the heat! Damn it! I love the style in this game, too. You'll all see soon. Mm -mm, bounce, bounce, bounce. I'm excited. Again, I might not make as much commentary since there is voice acting in this. So, <coughs> I might just make the sounds of me just interacting and enjoying it in general. Non-stop to the Bahamas! Puff. It's like that one commercial. Ten minute building, South Bronx, sometime after midnight. Hey, hello. Oh, Mr. Toad. Oh, shit. Uh oh. Baby. Listen, mate. I, I know I don't look human. It's a problem. I'll get it. I just stepped out the apartment for just a second to see what kind of damage this drunk shit is doing. Just cut me a break, yeah? I'll get me glamour first thing in the morning. Okay, good. Settings. Uh, gameplay. Audio, video. Yeah, yeah! Okay. Resume. Cross my arm. Uh, I'm looking for a three foot toad. To a fast. No harm done. Uh, no harm done. Look, no harm done. I'll give you a pass, but listen. If you can't afford to look human, you're going to the farm. It's as simple as that. You Silence is a valid option. Those animals. Ahem, you are an animal. You know what I mean. Go see a witch. Get a glamour. Big B, they're bleeding me dry, mate. The quality of the spout goes down, but the rates keep climbing up. 
Do you have any idea how much it costs to have an entire family in Glamour? A lot. Uh... Silence. It's not even really worth dwelling on at this point. You're telling me to get it together. Whatever it costs, it's worth it. You don't want me catching you out of Glamour again. Oh, shit! You know, see? This is what I told you about, Sheriff. You're just gonna stand there, do something, Big B, before he completely tears up the place. Uh. Oh, thanks for that, Big B. You're a real gentleman. I didn't press anything. This is the last straw, Big B. He has to go. I'm heading up. Fine. I'm heading up. Get your glamour. Damn it. Cool. Furry pricked up shite. Tell me how to spend my money. Dad, the lights are shaking again. What did I say? You want a big bad wolf to take you away? No. Then get that fuck back inside. Hey. Is that Ichabod? No, Ichabod. Uh. Oh, God. What was his name? From Rind in the Willows. Gonna know who I fucking am, you hear me? Hey, look at me. I need the fuck. Stop, okay? You're drunk. Let's go. How do I look at shit? Use the hand icon to pick it up. Take Where? A look. Take a good look. Know who I am now? Hey, look at me. Where is it? Where is the hand icon? Damn it. Well, now, while we're in here, let's look at the Book of Fables. New. No. Renowned Big Bad Wolf. He's known for tormenting pigs and girls in red hoods, but he's trying to put those dark days behind him. Big Bing now acts as Fable Town Sheriff and remains in his human form, mostly. However, due to his rough past, the citizens of Fable Town are slow to trust him. Big B is determined... To show that he's truly changed, but some instincts are just hard, too hard to control. Mr. Toad. Mr. Toad is a superintendent for a defunct tenement on the edge of Fable Town proper. He, because he's a three half and three and a half foot talking amphibian, Toad is required by Fable Town law to keep his family and himself magically glamoured to appear human. The problem is Toad isn't too concerned with the law is and has to be reminded often. Fable Town is a community labeled on a bull finch. Street in Manhattan's Upper West Side to regular people or Mundies, mundane. Um, it appears to be in an ordinary New York neighborhood, but it really is the home to fables from many worlds. Within the business office at Woodlands lies a massive cavern, a vast library, and hundreds of magical items with immense power. All non human fables live upstate on the farm and an extension of Fable Town. The farm is home to fables who cannot pass as humans, giants, goblins, animals, etc. It is located in upstate New York, far enough away from the Mundies to avoid detection. Some of its residents resent their confinement to the farm, despite its size and comforts. To them, the farm is a prison. They would be allowed to leave the farm if they could purchase a glamour, but many don't have the money for something so expensive. Though some, like Colin, sneak out into the city anyway. Glamours, decide spell. Glamours are spells that allow the user to change their appearance. They are expensive but can be purchased by non-human fables in or by non-human fables in order to pass for human among the Mundies. Cheap glamours can be found in the seedier parts of Fable Town, but they're often unreliable and prone to sudden failure. Huh. Okay, that makes me think. Aha! So it's the right trigger. Okay. Pick up. What up? Just gonna take that. That's book. Let's go. Let's see. Click. Okay, that's about it. What's that? They don't answer. Use force! Yes, I am a cop. Fuck you, I'm Big B Wolf. God 
Damn you! Hey! Whoa, 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 hey, hey! You've got something on your face. Fuck are you talking about, you stupid cur? <laughs> Bitch! Well, yeah, get him! You tell him! I'll fucking kill you! All right, you Ow! Bitch! What are you gonna fucking do, huh? Fuck him get up! Get the fuck out of the way before you get the axe again. This is your fucking last warning. Woody, this is your last warning. Woody. If you keep on like this, I won't have any choice but to put you down. Put me down? You got a shit fucking memory, Wolf. That's not how it went last time. This isn't last time. Yeah! <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> Ow! Uh, fuck. Oh, right. RT! Ow! Bitch! Stop it! Uh oh. Uh, yes! Get him! Right there! Right there! Right there! Let's trigger! Uh. You! You! Ow! Stop that! Or get him in the face! Get him in the face! Uh, there! Bottle! Get him! Yes! Ow! Down! Down! Punch! Punch! Shit! Ow! Ow! Uh oh! Fuck you! E! E! It works! Ha ha! Get him! Stay down. You should probably get out of here. Look, I'm not leaving until I get what's mine. You're not getting shit, bitch. Watch your mouth. I can put you on the ground. Hey, if you can't be nice, I'm gonna make you wait outside. Throw him out the window! Oh, fucking shit. You bogged my jaw, you bastard. You started it. Do you talk. Fuck you. Fuck you! What the hell is going on? What happened? Yeah. A little misunderstanding that turned into a real shit show. Don't worry. You saw the best bits. There's more where that came from, girly. I'm gonna fuck Knock you up. Off. Yeah. Look, this is just the start of a shitty night for me. I just need the money he owes me, then I can go. Are you alright? I'm hunky dory. Thanks for asking. Yeah, why, why was, was he, he hitting you? Maybe you should ask him that. I will, but I asked you first. Yeah! He asked me if I recognized him, knew who he was. I said I didn't. He started beating on me. Then you showed up, started beating on him. That about cover it, hon? I'm the woodsman, you whore. I saved Little Red Riding Hood from this monster. I cut this fucker open and filled his belly full of... Stones! Oh. And threw him in the fucking river. That's who the fuck I am, you stupid bitch! Throw him out! Hey, what did I say? I said be nice, or you wait out. Sorry. Throw him out! Yes! Wow. Okay, that hurt. Welp. Nah, I'm on a car. In the fucking Bronx. Ugh, shit. More garbage! Just- oh. Oh, I'm sorry. Hey, Toad. My car. I'm sorry! Uh, give me a second. Oh, no, by all means. Take your time. 
Make yourself comfortable. How's the street? Uh, sorry about the car. We ended up going out the window. Couldn't be avoided. I can't be mad at you. I called you, and you come to help. I can't be mad. But even when you help, things end up more fucked than they started. Well, I'm sorry for being efficient. Well, Damn it. At least you're not fucking dead. Uh oh. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Fuck you! Fuck you! Hey! Mm. Are you supposed to. No! I'm holding it! I'm pressing it as hard as I can! <gasps> oh! Jesus! Faith! <sighs> Thank you. Lost cat! Oh no. Damn. Hard head. Uh. Thanks. Don't mention it. No, seriously, don't mention it. I'm gonna get in trouble I'm just with getting what he owes me. Money. You know, right back there? I mean, your eyes and the teeth. You're not really supposed Pixel. to. Pixel. Oh, your name's Pixel. I, if I can avoid it. Great. Bitch. The guy's got an axe in his brain. He's not feeling that. It's more from me. He'll be. I'll kill you, you fucking bitch. <laughs> Letter. He's having a bad day. That makes two of us. I guess it's a good thing fables are hard to kill. Suppose it is. Mm -hmm. Come on. <clears throat> Give me that axe. There we go. Mongoose. Lips are sealed. Sorry. Okay. Well, what do you do for a job? Hey, you like my ribbon? Yeah, beautiful. Beautiful. It's a very cute ribbon. Thank you. I feel like we've met before. Have we? We probably have. We all sort of knew each other at one point or another. But things change, I guess. Yeah. I guess. Yeah. Up. Oh, he gone. Totally. Stop. We don't have to make any more of a thing out of it than it already is. Uh, he hit you. He hit you. He needs to pay for that. He's got nothing to give, Sheriff. I checked. Besides, I just swung an axe into the guy's head. I'd say we're even. Yeah. Maybe I should be arresting you. No! I'm not gonna be doing this for much longer. So, now's your chance. Do I feel a connection? Oh. How much was the OJ? A hundred. I'm guessing it'd be bad for you to show up empty handed. I'll be fine. You sure? 
Give her some money. Let's see, I've got uh, 20, 20, 7, 8, 58. It's all I got. Uh, it'll help, right? Take it. It's okay. I'll be fine. You've done enough, really. You sure? Just take the money, okay? You got me out of a bad situation back there. Thanks. I don't want her to get in trouble. I'm still gonna need a statement. I have to go drop off what I have. Meet me back at my office then. It's yeah. a little late for an office visit, Sheriff. I'll swing by your apartment. How do you know where I You live in the smallest apartment in the woodlands. Everyone knows that. Eh, fair. Good to know. You should get cleaned up. You look like shit. Thank you. I'm still and getting used I to don't use that term lightly. Some of these look pretty bad. Uh, that's gonna leave a mark, or maybe not. <laughs> I fucked up. Hey, I need to tell you something. Yeah. What is it? You're not as bad as everyone says you are. Oh, thank you. I'll see you around, Wolf. Thank you. My heart, Itoki. King! She's the king of my heart. Now. Dun -dun. We did it. Welcome to Fable Town. I wish I said something to her. Hey, we get the opening. Swag and uh, frame rate drops. That's what we get. Like, people might be thinking, oh, it's probably because your computer can't run it. No, it's probably because it's smaller than it's supposed to be, because I think this is meant to go on full screen, so... Yeah. <coughs> Sorry. I'll get better at this as I go along. That. Episode 1. Faith. Trust and pixie dust? Mm. The Woodland Luxury Apartments. Late. Oh, I can move. Let's see. Book of Fables. Let's see what new things we've learned. You. The Woodsman, Fallen Hero. The Woodsman is one of the few men who went toe to toe with Big B in these Black Forest days and lived to tell the tale. In an attempt to save Little Red Riding Hood, he split the great wolf's belly open with his axe and filled him with rocks and threw the beast into the river. To his dismay, his popularity had faded. Even his name is forgotten. He is only known as the Woodsman. Fair enough. Okay. Nothing. Okay. Nope, shit. Back achievements. Cool. Uh, zoom. Alright. I'll get used to this control system. It's not luxury at all, is it? I think Bill Willingham. Does that mean his name is William Willingham? Hmm. Oh, 
Hello? Hello? Come on out. Come on out. Hello? All right. All right. Hi! You're pretty. Beauty! Oh shit! Hello, Big B. Stay off the grass. I wasn't expecting anyone. Uh, where are you going? So, where are you off to? Well, I went for a walk. I don't see what's wrong with that. At like three in the morning? Say there was. It's not a big deal. Just, you know, out. For a walk. That's all. That's suspicious. Damn it. I'm late. Late for what? Suspicious. Please, Big B. Promise me you won't tell Beast you saw me. Oh? He worries too much as it is, and it would just make my life a lot easier. Sure. You uh, promise? Promise, cross me heart. Thank you, Big B. I'll explain it all to you later. I will, <coughs> but I have to go. Are you gonna get some glamour? Thank you for trusting me. Really, I I appreciate it, Big B. You're welcome. Let's uh let's head inside. Home sweet hum. Hello. Oh. Um, let's have a peek see. Been a while since I got any mail. Does anybody like me? Seventh day in a row. Nobody likes me. Just like me. I'm gonna read a beauty's thing real quick. Because I like backstory. Beauty and her husband, Beast, once lived in an enchanted castle, but they were forced to flee the homelands in the Exodus, leaving all their wealth behind. Now they live in a modest studio in Fabletown, New York. Though times have been hard, Beast working multiple jobs to pay the bill, the couple have the longest lasting relationship of all the fables. Caring wife. Oh, cute. Let's go. Uh, I'm gonna look at it. My catcher needs to dust this guy. Uh, I'm gonna touch him. Oof. I'm gonna look at him. Though, I'm gonna save that for next time to speak to him and shit. Cause we're running out of time. So this has been a very interesting first case. I am not the best yet and I need to learn to make options before people finish speaking or else I'm gonna accidentally go into silence and accidentally fuck up. Cause I feel bad of saying being silent to faith. But yeah, exit game. I want to quit. Uh, and turn to the desktop. Also, I'm sorry for both. Cause I think the uh, loading in the corner is the auto save, so I think I'm fine. Yeah, let's do that. Yes. And it just cuts me out. Okay. Sure. Why not? So next time I'm gonna look at other shit. So have a good day, everybody. Bye.